we're getting to our hook. We gotta move them a little bit, but the, the main goal is combing the hair, getting that hook full. We, a lot of times we get to this hook and we don't use it enough. We just get there and we just kind of sit there. All right, so we get to this hook, we're controlling it. Now, all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna step outside with my back leg and give him a little bit of a plug, just to try to get his elbows away from his body. So I'm gonna step to the side with my back foot, and then I'll think about doing is finding a hole right here and punch my hook. When I punch my hook, I'm automatically gonna circle and try to find the pocket right here. Okay? Now, based off of his reaction, I might have an immediate attack. All right? But we're gonna get to this position again. You can be on the shoulder, straight across the back. I'm starting to like this kind of hand across the back a little bit more. It helps me open this window up. Now, second thing we're gonna do is bring our attack hand in, and we're gonna put a hook right here on the same side as of our underhook. I'm not collar tying. Notice, I'm stepping to the opposite side, and I'm just dropping my elbow straight down. I'm making a hook, and I'm dropping it straight down. Now, once I get to this position, my head's gonna be in the hole, and I'm just gonna circle and pull. Yeah, I'm gonna circle and pull. This gives me a, a, a giant window to operate from, but it also really taxes this guy's low back. It makes him want to square up. And then as he starts to square up, I can start getting back to combing my hair, pulling the hook, and penetrating a little bit. But the more I pull with the hook, the less I have to go penetrate and get the leg. So I'm in my stance. Back step up, club, punch to the outside, I'm circling. Now as I circle, the tack hand's gonna come in. Block, block, block. It's almost like I'm pushing his elbow, or pushing with my elbow, and trying to get his ear away from his shoulder. He doesn't like that. So as he fights the square back up and he can drive into me, that's where my attack's gonna be. Okay, outside club comes up, we'll start to finish. So one more time. Club punch. Circle, pull, 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 right here. Feet are set. This position. Release, pull, straight over the top. You'll start getting this outside shelf a little bit. Sometimes you might just get a run down double. Sometimes you might end up in that kind of Iranian position where we're scooping far leg. Any questions? Go as slow as you need to, but we're getting to a dominant tie. We're creating a dominant angle. And then as they fight the square back up, we're pulling that hook over the top, getting to our high crash. Double works the same, okay? Well, front, circle, circle, pull here. Right into my double, okay? Double works the same. If you only want to shoot doubles, then shoot doubles. Doesn't matter to me. Because what do we change out to from our high crotch a lot? Double. Double A, right? Questions? Go!